welcome back to my channel and here if you were new if you were on my channel hello girl and welcome to my channel i hope that you will enjoy watching this video and you will find this video helpful and then you will decide to click that subscribe button down there for you to become a part of my beloved family so for today guys i am back with a new segment here on my channel and i'm going to call it the battle of so basically, this new segment is all about a comparison review between two products from different brands that has the same concept, idea, formulation, and all those kinds of things. So basically, every battle in this new segment will have six different rounds. So the first round will be the packaging of the products. Then secondly is the price. Third is the shade selection. Fourth is the ease of application. Fifth is the pigmentation of the product. And then lastly, the lasting power of each of the product. So, for the month of November, I am going to start this battle of segment with the battle of the brow products because I do love to collect, you know, brow products and try different one so i will be sharing with you guys my thoughts about the different products from different brands that has the same idea or concept and then i will be sharing with you guys which of which is worth your money so i will be starting it off with the maybelline fashion brow versus the l'oreal paris designer pro brow artist so let the battle begin Okay, so as you can see, Maybelline is contained in a black container and it is um, divided into two parts. So the first part is the pencil which has a thin and rounded shape and on the other end is the powder with a sponge applicator. L'Oreal Designer Pro Brow Artist is contained in a metallic silver packaging and it is divided into three parts. First is the pencil which has a flat triangular shape and in the middle you will be able to see there the powder that also has a sponge applicator. And the last part is the brow spoolie. So Maybelline Fashion Brow Duo cost 399 pesos while the L'Oreal Designer Pro Brow Artiste cost 500 pesos. They actually both have two shades available. For the Maybelline one, they have chestnut brown and then dark brown. And for the L'Oreal one, they have um, light and dark brown. Okay, so the first um, product that I will be applying on my brow is the Maybelline Fashion Brow Duo Shaper. So um, the first thing that I am going to do is just outline the shape of my brows and then fill it in with the powder. So as you guys can see, I really have to use some force just for me to be able to get the pigmentation out of this product. For me, the the formulation of this product is way too dry so it's really hard for me to get the pigmentation of this product and then since it doesn't come in with a brush I still need to use my own spoolie and um, the powder um, just did the same thing um, it's not as pigmented as I wanted it to be I believe that this product will be um, beginner friendly because um, you cannot go wrong with this product but for me um, since I do have a short brow I didn't like how it applied on my brows
Okay, so the next one that I'm going to apply on my left brow is the L'Oreal Designer Pro Brow Artist. So as you guys can see, um, it is pigmented so I didn't have to use some force just for me to get the pigmentation out of it and it also glides on smoothly on my brows like when I am shaping it and um, the formulation of this one is not that creamy or waxy and it's also not super duper dry compared to the Maybelline one so I think that formulation wise and the ease of application I am um, impressed with this product and since it comes in with a spoolie I just have to you know blend the product out and then after that set it with the powder the powder is also pigmented and it also filled in the sparse area of my brows which is what I really like Um, the pigmentation of the L'Oreal one is way better than the Maybelline one. I really have to, you know, go through the Maybelline one over and over again just for me to be able to get it. While on the L'Oreal one, I didn't have any problem getting the pigmentation of the product. And then lastly, both of this product really last a very long time. On your brows it can actually go all throughout the day but you still need to reapply on some of the areas of your brows on both of this product so for me the winner of this battle is the L'Oreal designer pro brow artist um, brow product because as I said it's very pigmented a little goes a long way it glides on smoothly it lasts longer on your brows and since it comes in with a spoolie you are not going to hassle yourself in bringing any brush whenever you are traveling so it's very travel friendly so that is it for today's battle of the brows segment here on my channel i hope that you guys enjoyed watching this new segment here on our channel and if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for you guys to become updated on my new video uploads and for you guys to become a part of my beloved family yes that is it for today guys thank you so much for watching you guys know that i love you so much don't forget what i always say to you guys don't let your dreams trust me dreams thank you guys now i'll see you guys on my next video bye